Hi, I'm Peter from Coffee Parts, and today we're looking at some of the variants you can get with the Fiorenzata range of coffee grinders. So effectively, on the commercial range of Fiorenzato grinders, you have three models, the F74 Evo, the F71 EK, and the F83E. Now within those models, you got multiple variants, and two of the variants are the XGI, which is shown here being a grind by weight, and the Pro feature, with the ability to remove the collar by just pulling two clamps. With the XGI grinders, it's Fiorenzato's range of grind by weight grinders. And what they've effectively done is added the base under the grinder. And that base is actually weighing the grinder and holding the porter filter. So there is no weight here, this is connected to the base. And it's the actual grinder that's being weighed. And that is different to most grinders. Most grinders that are grinding by weight, they're actually weighing the porter filter and working out how much ground coffee is going into the porter filter. This is working out the weight of the grinder and the coffee and working out how much coffee is being removed from the grinder. So let's look at it in action. Over here on the screen, just like the timer model, you can go in and adjust each one, so the single or the double, or if you have the three selected, single, double and triple, what weight you want. So at the moment we have 20 grams. Important feature to note is if you wanted to stop using the weight, you can go back and just run it as a timer model. So how many seconds you're grinding. And effectively, over here, we have 20 grams. And when we put in the porter filter, nothing is happening. But when we grind, it's going to remove 20 grams from the hopper. So it's going to it's weighing the grinder and when it, it's lighter by 20 grams, because now it's in the porter filter, which is against the base, it's going to stop the grinder. That out. As we grind it out, it will then tell you what it actually grounds. So we wanted 20 grams, and it will come up on the screen and say exactly how many grams came out. 19.9. So in this case, we were 0.1 of a gram off, but within a variance that's acceptable. And what it did, it weighed the grinder, and as the grinder became 20 grams lighter, it cut it off. Effectively, you probably cut it off just before because it does have fuzzy logic that learns what it ground, what it was expecting, and when to stop that murder. It keeps constantly learning. If there is a change in weight, to say you want it to go to 18 instead of 20 grams, it does take three grinds for the grinder to reset itself. One thing to note with this grinder, it needs to be on a stable bench. So vibration in the bench or even wind can just move it around a bit and normally what it does, it shows two little arrows like it just showed there, to show that it's just thinking to recalibrate itself. Now it's not an issue, we will still grind, but you're gonna get a more consistent grind when the grinder is stable. Looking at this side, another feature you can get with the Fiorenzata range is called the Pro feature. And what it is, is the collar up here now can be removed with just two clamps that you pull out and you can lift the whole collar out. What that's used for is, at the end of the day, you can pull the collar out, give it a clean, and put it back together. Not only quickly and easily, but without losing your grind, so you don't have to dial that grind back in. Also, if you wanted to change the blades on the grinder, it's super quick. This might mean that when the technician's coming, they're in and out quicker, not affecting your service run, and also, less time with technician normally means less cost. On this grinder, because it doesn't have the pro feature, you'd have to go coarser, coarser, coarser till the collar comes out and then finer, and then you'd have to redial your grinder back in. Now, you could get the XGI with the pro feature. You can get just a pro feature or just the XGI or a standard grinder without either of those two features. And that's why the three models have four variants. So effectively, the standard model, the model with the pro feature, the model with the XGI, grind on the man, and the model with both XGI and Pro. And that explains the range. And that's a common question we've been getting asked because the range is quite big in the sense of the, you can mix and match the features, people have been getting a little bit confused. But hopefully that clarifies it. We've actually done a video on each of the models. The F64 EVO, which is a flat blade 64 mil grinder. The F71 EK, which is a 71 mil conical blade grinder. And this. The F83E, which is a flat 83mm burr grinder. But if you have any questions on the XGI feature or the Pro feature, let me know in the comments below. And like always, 
this video has brought you value, hit that thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe. Thank you and see you on the next video.